Hello, Bishop State, and welcome to another Tech Tip Tuesday and 2 with your host, Robert McWin. Today's tip is more of an informational video, and I've been asked this um, from, from many co-workers and, and others. Um, can I still use Windows 7? Now, as you notice, or may have heard, uh, Windows or Microsoft uh, ended support for Windows 7 in January the 14th of 2020. So let's go over a little Windows 7 or Windows timeline, if you will. Windows 7 was released to the general public in October the 22nd of 2009. So we're all we're working with a over 10 year old operating system if you're working on Windows 7. Um, the last major service pack to Windows 7 was released in February of 2011. Um, now, Windows 8 was released in 2012. Um, wasn't as popular or received as Windows 7 uh, was. Windows 8.1 came out in 2013. Um, still wasn't as received or welcome as Windows 7. Now, Windows 10 came out in July of 2015. So now Windows 10, which is the latest operating system, actually at this point is five years old. So Windows 7 reached its end of life uh, in January 14th of 2020, as already mentioned. Uh, and of course, mainstream support for Windows 7 as by provided by Microsoft ended in January of 2015. And of course, the end of life was January 14, 2020. Um, so if you're running Windows 7, you're not by yourself. 28% as of November 2019 of all traditional PCs, desktops, laptops are running Windows 7. So there's only 70% uh, <laughs> give or take that's running 10. So you're not all the way behind. You're not by yourself. So will my computer blow up now that it's in January or past January 14th, 2020? No, your computer will not broke, blow up. You can still use Windows 7 with caution. Um, so we, Windows 7 will boot up, start as it did in the past. However, you will not be getting any new updates uh, from Microsoft. Therefore, any new viruses that may come through, you would be susceptible to those viruses. Any new programs that come out from any manufacturer now would not support Windows 7 because, after all, if Microsoft themselves is not supporting Windows 7, nobody else will either. Um, again, remember, if you continue to use a Windows 7 machine, you will be more vulnerable to security risks. So not only will your computer be at risk, but perhaps your flash drives, external hard drives, things of that nature will be more susceptible to viruses and things of that nature um, if you continue to use Windows 7. So if you work at Bishop State, um, which most of you who see this video do, um, feel free to contact computer services let them know that you're running a windows 7 machine and to upgrade you in essence that has been today's tip hope you enjoyed it thank you so much for watching